हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द चैनल केमिकल इंजीनियर आई एम साई यादव एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल बी डिस्कसिंग अबाउट द फर्टिलाइजर इंडस्ट्रीज सो वी आर स्टार्टिंग अवर फर्टिलाइजर इंडस्ट्रीज सो इन दिस वीडियो आई विल गिव यू ब्रीफ वाई द फर्टिलाइजर्स आर यूज एंड विच आर द इंडस्ट्रीज दैट आर प्रोड्यूसिंग फर्टिलाइजर इन इंडिया सो द फर्टिलाइजर इज यूज टू जनरली इम्प्रूव और एक्स एनहेंस द क्वालिटी ऑफ द सॉइल ओके so how it can enhance the quality so it can uh, generally uh, used for uh, providing the nutrients to the soil like nitrogen potassium and phosphorus so these three are the important nutrients that are required for any plant to grow okay so for proper by proper application of 1 ton of balanced fertilizer we can form a 10 tons of more or additional food grains hence we can say that the use of fertilizer should be done because it uh, forms the additional quantity of food for the developing countries so in india it should be promoted to use fertilizer as well as india is the fourth uh, largest producer for fertilizer hence the we can understand that uh, the importance of fertilizer in agricultural sector so chemical engineer generally produces fertilizer based on nitrogen phosphorus and po potassium so mainly fer fertilizers used for soil are characterized by the constituent that is the element present in it so it is nitrogen phosphorus and potassium so you have to decide that when to use which fertilizer so nitrogen fertilizer is generally used to promote the development of soil or uh, development of stem and leaves so for the development of the stems and leaves we provide nitrogen fertilizer so in nitrogen fertilizer we have uh, ammonia then nitric acid then we have urea okay so these three types are the nitrogen fertilizers so they are generally uh, used by a plant during the early stages of plant growth that is to promote the development of stems and soil uh, leaves okay so nitrogen fertilizer is used during the early stages of plant growth next we require phosphorus so phosphorus uh, stimulates the early growth and accelerates the seeding so the flowering or the seeding or in the plant is accelerated by the phosphorus fertilizers so phosphorus is, is uh, obtained in various forms that we will uh, study in the next or subsequent videos so this phosphorus is generally used to accelerate the seeding or fruit formation in the later stage of plant so during the early stage plant require only nitrogen and potassium okay so nitrogen and potassium are required for the plant in the early stage while phosphorus is required when seeding and fruits are needed and potassium is helpful in growing the roots then preventing plant from any disease and it also lessens the effect of excess nitrogen to the plant okay so when we supply the nitrogen nitrogenous fertilizer to the plant it may occur it may act as a poison to the plant okay so in order to uh, lessen its effect we also provide potassium fertilizer simultaneously with nitrogen fertilizer okay so potassium so best example of potassium fertilizer is a banana so in banana well you may have seen various videos so when you keep that aloe vera plant in a banana by uh, doing some hole type structure then it uh, the roots of the aloe vera plants tend to grow within 2 to 3 days so what actually happening in th that process is the potassium so banana has potassium and that potassium is used for the growing of roots by aloe vera plant so that is why the roots uh, for growing the better roots potassium type or potassium based fertilizers are used so india ranks fourth in the production of fertilizer so by the end of this video i am this, this is a last slide so you have to comment down the top 3 countries name which are uh, in the most list of the fertilizer production okay so in india we have ifco that is indian farmer uh, indian fertilizer farmer corporation limited 
इंडियन फार्मर्स फर्टिलाइजर कॉपरेशन लिमिटेड देन राष्ट्र इस्पत निगम एच एफ सी एल दैट इज़ हिंदुस्तान फर्टिलाइजर कॉपरेशन लिमिटेड फर्टिलाइजर कॉपरेशन ऑफ इंडिया एफ सी आई सेल दैट इज स्टील अथॉरिटी ऑफ इंडिया लिमिटेड देन टीस्को दैट इज द टाटा आयरन स्टील कंपनी जी एस एफ सी दैट इज गुजरात स्टेट फर्टिलाइजर कॉपरेशन जी एन एफ सी दैट इज गुजरात नर्मदा वैली फर्टिलाइजर कॉपरेशन क्रिपको कृषिक भारती कॉपरेशन दीपक फर्टिलाइजर सो दिस आर द टॉप टेन इंडस्ट्रीज इन इंडिया फॉर द फर्टिलाइजर प्रोडक्शन सो ऑल ऑफ दिस इंडस्ट्रीज डिपेंड्स ऑन द टाइप ऑफ फर्टिलाइजर लाइक इफको प्रोड्यूस नाइट्रोजन पोटेशियम एंड नाइट्रोजन फॉस्फोरस एंड पोटेशियम सो एन पी के सो एन पी के टाइप फर्टिलाइजर्स आर जनरली यूज बाय द फार्मर्स विच इन्वॉल्व द all the three components that is required for the growth of plant so by mixing into a certain quantity we can form npk fertilizer so npk fertilizer is a combination of nitrogen phosphorus and potassium based fertilizers so if co produce all of them while rashtra ispat nigam generally focuses on the nitrogen and potassium based fertilizers hfcl is also the npk type that is all the three Fertilizer Corporation of India is generally producing nitrogenous based fertilizer. Sale and Tisco are the main for the production of the phosphorus and potassium based fertilizer. Moreover, nitrogenous fertilizers are produced in almost every industries. GNFC and GSFC. These both are NPK specialist. They are both present in Gujarat. So they are actually the biggest industry for fertilizer. and they have highly equipped uh, machineries so gsfc and gnfc and cripco and deepak fertilizer limited both are also uh, doing well so deepak fertilizer forms the nitrogenous based fertilizer that is urea okay and cripco is also uh, forming the nitrogen based fertilizer urea while it also produces some uh, phosphorus based too okay so these are all the top industries for the fertilizer production so this video is just to give you a glimpse that how fertilizer can be useful for our plant growth as in agri agriculture industries so i end this video here and uh, i request you all to please watch the video because yesterday i have uploaded the video on sulfur based industries i have found that only the average watch time of 34 minute video is just a 10 seconds so each person viewed that viewed it at for only 10 seconds so uh, i don't think it will be helpful for you i am uploading video for your help nothing else so please watch it okay so in next video i will be discussing about nitrogen based fertilizer industries that is ammonia and urea and so in the next video we will discuss about ammonia and urea industries as well as we will discuss about its flow sheet and major engineering problems okay so you will i hope you will enjoy those videos so i end this video here if you haven't subscribed to us till now please subscribe us and thank you for watching the video okay